So I started the brand in Fort Myers. I was getting a degree in environmental studies, fell in love with coastal ecosystems. Keith was studying horticulture at the time. After a year or so of beating on the door with the county, they kind of like let us start joining projects with them. And then we became basically the, like one of the more official tree planting partners for Palm Beach County. We'll be eight years in September now. So it's crazy, time flies. Keith and I used to run every show and event together, and now we've got a great couple teammates under us that are really yeah. helping us to push the ball forward, and yeah, it's fun to grow. I worked on the water all through high school. I always knew I would love doing something that yeah. surrounded myself with the water, and that was the catalyst that just kind of yep. tied all of, it, like all of it together with mangroves. We are out here today at beautiful South Cove in downtown West Palm Beach. We've got our partners from Delta Airlines, Ryobi, and Milwaukee, and we're planting down some mangroves. We've got 153 gallon mangroves going in the ground, and we're stoked to be planting some more. We've got our friend Nacho here, the regional manager of South Florida. He's the one who introduced us to Delta. Thrilled to be here with the Mang Foundation, with Keith and Kyle and the Mang family, all of our Delta employees worldwide. Uh, come out here to give back to the South Florida community, and we can't wait to continue the partnership with the Mang Foundation and to help our ecosystems here in West Palm Beach and throughout the entire world. South Cove was built about 12 years ago, so they're starting to see some erosion in different places as the islands have settled over the years. So what we're doing today is we're going to plant mangroves in an effort to enhance the shoreline. These islands were some of the first islands we've ever planted as a company. And these are a testament of time to really show in like all the hard work that we've put in over the years and how resilient mangrove ecosystems are and how they create so much habitat for our wildlife that surrounds us. We planted on South Cove, Bryant Park, Grassy Flats, and Tarpon Cove, and all these amazing habitats and shorelines that have been created here. <laughs> Everyone get a drink of water. You're gonna grab your shovels and tools and we're, uh, we're gonna start shuffling people over to Island B and then we'll start doing the same thing all over again. So we are located here right in the heart of downtown West Palm. Clematis Street is just right up the road. Palm Beach County is the seawall to seawall and it's projects like these that really bring the green back into our lagoon, really bring that life back in our lagoon that was, that was gone. You know, when you have concrete seawalls, there's nowhere for fish and habitat. There's nowhere for your detrital food webs that really kickstart the life in our ocean. So by creating these little micro ecosystems within our larger lagoon, we're restoring the greatness of not only our inshore species that we have here in Palm Beach County, but we're helping to feed our offshore reefs. With the introduction of these islands, we're seeing endangered bird species and fish that are moving into the mangrove root. So mangroves and the economy go hand in hand because mangroves provide habitat for 70% of all marine life. original mangrove from our planting over five years ago. Uh, we're just so excited to be finishing up this shoreline today and really seeing all the greenery that's added to this beautiful landscape. So guys, we just want to say thank you so much for, for supporting us, watching our channels, watching our mission, and ultimately, we'd love to encourage you guys to subscribe to our page, like our content, and throw a comment in there saying, what's up, man?